I need five quiet kids who's quiet. You. One of the tools that we use is living iambic pentameter. Yeah. That helps them get a feel for the rhythm of Shakespeare's language. You are. You bring up ten kids, one. five soft-spoken kids, and five kids that want to be loud. And you get them standing up in a line, and you hand them out a, a card. One card says ta, one card says tum. And you simply get them to say the sound. Your sound is stamp your foot when you say it, okay? One, two, three, go. Tum. Iambic pentameter yeah. is the very simple thing with a very big, scary, intimidating name. This is an I am. So I all it is is just making something that looks scary like. easy. They feel a little smarter when they get it. When you have five iams in a line of verse, you have iambic pentameter. And it sounds like this. This rhythm is your heartbeat. It's very romantic, that rhythm. Mm -hmm. So Shakespeare uses this rhythm when the lines are full of emotion or when it's something very formal. Let's say you were playing a king. It's very human. Ta-tum, 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 ta-tum becomes but soft what light through yonder window breaks. Okay, go. But. Soft what light through yonder window breaks. It is the east. And I know that when they go home and their parents say, what did you do today? If they say, well, we were living iambic pentameter, their parents will go, oh my gosh, wow. So take your vows, all right? It's not scary. And that's the whole purpose.